Hello. Um, sorry it's taken so long. Uh, I've, well, you know, life. Um, today I wanted to, I wrote this whole script out to tell you about why I like castles so much. Um, however, I'm basically just going to show you clips and hope you fall in love with it. Because for starters, sassy female detective. Oh yeah. Okay, gauntlet your right fist in your left palm. <laughs> Shot too soon. Yeah, well, you know we could always just cuddle castle. Oh. And then you've got a lovable writer who is a bit arrogant. Um, played by Nathan Fillion, so if you love Firefly or anything else he's been in, which you know, if you know him, obviously you love it. Um, he's in it. He's very cheeky. Do I look like a killer to you? Yes, you kill my patients. And then you have the basic NYPD team, who are hilarious together. They're like this cute little family, and it's worth watching just for those, I swear. Um, and not only that, there are other stuff throughout the series that you can buy outside. So, for instance, Castle's a writer and he writes murder mystery novels. Well, you can buy them. This is the fourth one. Um, third one. Second one, which I'm currently reading. And the first one. The one that starts everything off in the TV series. There are two kinds of folks who sit around thinking about how to kill people. Psychopaths and mystery writers. I'm the kind that pays better. Who am I? I'm Rick Castle. 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 I really am ruggedly handsome, aren't I? Every writer needs inspiration, and I've found mine. Detective Kate Beckett. 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 Nikki Heat. The character he's basing on you. And thanks to my friendship with the mayor, I get to be on her case. I'd be happy to let you spank me. And together we catch killers. Make a pretty good team, you know. Like Starsky and Hutch. Turner and Hooch. You do remind me a little There are it. also graphic novels that also star in the series, which you can buy. They look like this. And and that that's pr that's pretty much it. Like you could, you have a lot of stuff that you'll be able to to laugh at, especially Firefly references. Um, there's several of those in in Castle. Also sci-fi references. Um, and it's really good for anyone who is a writer because it shows that you do get writer's block. I mean, he's a best-selling novelist and he spends days just sitting with his computer with a fabulous, fabulous screensaver that tells him that he should be writing. On a different note, still with Nathan Fillion, if anybody has seen Joss Whedon's Dr. Horrible sing-along blog with Neil Patrick Harris and Felicia Day in it as well as Nathan Fillion, you'll be happy to know that there's a graphic novel of it. Of course, most of you probably already have this because I seem to be way behind on the times. So um, that's that's basically today's clog. Um, and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it's given you a little bit more knowledge. Okay.